Hi everyone, welcome to the Fuga. We started to work on our floors in a guest room and hallway. And uh, Ilya gonna explain what we are aiming for. Yeah, it was a lot of question why we are removing this floor. And it's because this floor uh, was put on ground, a little bit of sand and ground. So, and we want to do it properly. And According to the current standards. Yeah, yeah, yeah and insulate it. So, yeah, let, let me, me show you. Show you. So, uh, <laughs> not show this way. <laughs> so, it's like it's our wall, and it's like ground, and this is a current level of the floor. So, uh, right now it was just tile and a little bit of sand here and that's all but uh, what we need right now we need to uh, dig out everything uh, something like uh, 45 50 centimeters and put some layer of sand here like 10 centimeters uh, put a uh, slab of concrete with metal enforcing approximately 15 centimeters and yeah, plus minus uh, put insulation and put uh, uh, I don't remember how it's not yeah screed screed yeah screed le uh, something it's like maybe seven ten centimeters and here is depends on this is insulation yeah 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 this is insulation and depends on <laughs> with insulation uh, we need to level up to keep here like three centimeters three centimeters for uh floor covering so mm -hmm. So uh, this is what we're gonna do in our uh, today's video, digging out the sand out of our guest room. Please enjoy the time lapses. And like and subscribe. <laughs> okay, let's go. Yeah, let's, let's go. go. <laughs>
really hard to dig here because it's like I know it's like leftovers of terracotta uh, on uh, uh, some I don't know, dirt and uh, <coughs> lime mortar or I have no idea or maybe they just put all, all broken stuff here so but it's harder to dig out of this trash and also there are some holes <laughs> like under this drinking uh, Stella Artois beer I think it's well known uh, beer in the world yeah, sold like uh, yeah, ev everywhere mm -hmm. so yeah. we drink it in Ukraine we I know that people in the United States really like it mm -hmm. and you can find it everywhere so why we're drinking Stella right now because we want to tell yeah some story about to share a story yeah, yes to absolutely. share to share stories so uh, on our attic we oh, uh, okay. <laughs> that's, that's that. so we found i'll put a link to the video where we were exploring the attic and on this attic we found the bottle yeah so we found a bottle about uh, mena mena brewery in rotsellar rotsellar Rot Rot yeah Rot so and I, I'm start checking. Uh, yeah, find, start. I find some information about this this brewery. So it's it was very old brewery. 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 It was opened in uh, 1997, but then it was closed in 1969. Not closed. It was. Uh, yeah, Stella, Stella company bought with brewery yeah. and yeah they just close uh, in a few years they just close the, yeah, the brewery and uh, yeah stop all production and uh, I found that uh, this building from this brewery right now is converted to a culture culture center from with center. a big uh, with a it's like beer museum, library, some something like that. So, yeah. 
Yeah, that's why we yeah, decided, decided to buy Stella, but usually we don't drink it. <laughs> oh, normally we don't. Yeah. It's very light and... Uh, so... It's interesting detail about the bottle that you cannot find anymore. Yeah, and unfortunately it was not cracked. We have only one bottle, right? Yeah, only one bottle for this many Still beers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, hmm. yeah, I also read the story why they, it's called Mena. Why? It's uh, the first name of two partners that opened the beer. One was Mia, and another surname started with Na. So uh, it was okay. a combination of two uh, surnames. Okay. So I removed a uh, layer of sand from here and other building fresh uh, to have space to, uh, to do nice foundation for our floors. Uh, I found this foundation uh, from the previous layout of the room of the building and I need to remove it to uh, free space for concrete. Uh.
check what I found. It's I don't know how it's in English. Ilya found a pipe in our, in the floor, in the sand of our <laughs> guest room. We asked uh, one of our friends to, who had, uh, who has a metal detector, to come to us and to check what's uh, in there. And we can show you the results. What we have found. We have found. Yeah, this is a lot of really strange stuff. It's like some iron uh, maybe nails or i don't know this is, this is a big one this is a yeah, big yeah big i don't know what it is. it's rusted yeah it's really rusted it's really in bad shape so and it's <laughs> really one. nice hook <laughs> i want to keep this it's really cool yes yeah, it's, it's nice hook so some copper stuff uh, and also here is the most interesting part it's from maybe belt or from I don't know how to call it this is an uh, icon yeah it's it's like icon but it's really rusted uh, there is no fo normal focus So this is uh, from uh, cement, it's la labeled uh, Portland cement and so it's free the same. Yeah, and uh, some really strange stuff. <laughs> yeah, and it was another part, ah, and here. They was together, but... They were together. They were together, but I have no idea what is it. And also the coins. Two of them, it's like really unreadable, it's just uh, two pieces of metal. <laughs> and this one, it's two cent and it's from Netherlands. And uh, yeah, here is a date he showed. It's like na uh, 18, 9 or 86, something like that. So also yeah. a button, a small ah, yeah, one. Yeah, it's That's also awesome. small, uh, and it has some pattern here around. So we can do a photo and attach it, but a lot of treasure. Also, probably a nail. It goes here. Yeah, this is chest. Yeah, and <laughs> something, <laughs> just a stick to hit. If you do your job bad, I'll keep it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good one. <laughs> That's what we we have found. No, and no here, jewelry he, again. He, here is some uh, tool. I don't know. It's look like 
Armor, ¿no? Pero... Yeah, really strange. Yeah, that's all. <laughs> so this is it for today. Thank you very much for joining us today. Uh, please like and subscribe if you want to follow our journey. We also have a Patreon page if you would like to join us uh, and to get some extra access to some uh, videos about financial aspects and our future plans. Please become our Patreon. You are more than welcome. See you next week. Bye. Bye.